Hello everybody, and welcome to part one of War Thunder. Um, it is just me right now. Um, this is my PS4, this is now my PC. I just got a brand new uh, desktop for a PC. It right now is does not have a keyboard. Uh, I need to go buy one really quick. So like, I don't know, two or three days I might have one. I don't know when, but till then I'm just gonna make a few videos on War Thunder. You know, whatever I can be some infinite warfare because I also got that and a bunch of other stuff like Fallout 4. And yeah, there's gonna be a lot of new playlists coming up guys. Um but till then, um let's do some more thunder, shall we? Uh I did play a little bit and get like one tank and like um some decent like one of the first okay planes. So just so I don't have to be World War One and keep dying all the time. But, um, yeah, let's see if we can, um, kill some people as a tank, because I'm playing as Russia, planes and tanks. Um, right now I was researching, uh, the T-50, I'm almost done with it right now, but I only got the T-26, the BT-5, the BT-7, and the first anti-air. Which, really quick, I'm gonna show you guys the... Sorry, I just kinda ate, guys, so... If I keep, like, stopping a little bit, it's because of that. Um, but this is the very first anti-air for Russia. If you guys don't know what that gun is, that is from World War One. That is a... Not good anti-air. Same with the second, I'm just gonna really quick show you guys how the second one looks, and... Golly, it is not that good as you guys can see it's just a little 50 cal but what really sucks about it is it only shoots one bullet every like two seconds it's like boom 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 so it's really sucky and at the same time it's just it's really really dumb until you get to like the third anti-air for russia then it starts to be like flak and stuff but besides that it's you know not good and yeah, let's see how many kills we can get with Russia, shall we? Um, do keep in mind, like I said, my PC is not running right now, so I cannot do Warframe or Happy Wheels or any other playlist right now. So those will have to wait till I, I get a new keyboard. Which if I don't get it within this week that I post this video, um. I will 100% get it this weekend. Um, okay, I like to start out with the BT-7 because it's the upgraded version of the BT-5, which is then a medium. I, I know it's a light tank, but it's more of a medium because of the armor and the cannon-wise. And it also goes so fast that I would not call this a light tank. Like, the armor I know is light, but this is not like to me a light tank at all if you guys are looking for good tanks i recommend you go with either america russia or germany depends on what you like because the uk uh does not have good tanks in war thunder and if you guys are also looking for uh and japan kind of just came out with their tanks they don't even have them all unlocked yet so you can't even really be japan i mean can, but there's really no point because you only get to choose between like five tanks and two of them you only get to research twice so that's really stupid so I recommend if you guys are gonna play this game go with either America Germany or Russia they are great tanks to choose from plane wise I it depends on what you like high altitude low altitudes just okay to everything good at bombing you know just it's whatever you like to use is the faction you, like, would want. So, each faction has its perks to it. Oh my god, I'm trying to get caught so I'm trying to really quick. Critical hit. 
Guess you gotta slow her. This is why you guys gotta watch your surroundings. Why did not kill his gunner? Did not kill his gunner. This what really sucks about it being in a PS4 playing War Thunder is that you always have to do this. I'm just gonna have my cannon this way because there's a guy over there. And if he comes this way and I become a tank again after becoming an attacker plane, I can then destroy his tank without a worry. Um, is there any anti-airs around here? I hope there's a PZ-3 I can take out in two seconds, but I'm not going to do that. Because I like to kill Russian tanks. The easiest thing. Because Russian tanks have the least amount of armor in the beginning. So if you ever guys see a Russian tank, make sure to shoot it directly in the front turret part, like where the driver would be. Because then you'll one-shot the tank anytime, unless it's, you know, a tier 2 or tier 3 then. And you're not going to get anywhere. Okay, guys, we're becoming a fighter and we're risking our lives right now just for it to kill this bomber. Because I do not trust this bomber, I swear he's gonna attack A. Oh no, he's attacking a Jag Tiger. Well, where that Jag Tiger is, he is really dead. Or maybe not. <laughs> extinguisher! Extinguisher! seconds but at least we get the horizontal turret back so at least that's good um are you are you kidding me really no I, i'm dead m2 was right there the entire time and i did not even notice it <sighs> well that's what happens when you don't pay attention 
You die. Um, well, at least we got A still, so if we gave it a little bit longer, we win. Guys, this is why you want to shoot the guy directly in front. One shot in. Time to come up, become a bomber, guys. Crap! What the heck just shot me? Of course the little T-26, he's gonna die if he doesn't move. I know I most likely ran to myself and I'm dead, but so is he. He's gonna be dead. <laughs> he backed into the bullet. Why? Th there was no point of going anywhere, but then he decided to back into the bullet or the bomb. Sorry if I keep saying bullet. Uh, bomb. He got backing into the bomb. What the heck did I even get a bullet in that? Um. But he backed into the bull uh, bomb. Bomb. He backed into the bomb. There. Why do I keep wanting to say bullet? I just continuously want to keep saying it for some reason. Every time I say it, he keeps backing into it. Friendly. Now guys, do keep in mind, if I keep getting kills like this, it's because I've played this game already and nearly gone to tier 10 tanks. I am a, actually a pretty good pro at this game, so if you guys are like wondering why I'm at tier 1 then, it's because in PS4, you cannot add your Steam account unless you're like the first 100th person to ever get War Thunder on the PS4. That is why... I do not have all of my stuff. If I had all my stuff, I would have a German jet right now, and I would not be a tank. I'd probably actually be playing as America and get my T-95 or whatever. Kill people with it. Um, come on. There. God, that takes forever to do sometimes. Okay. Um, really quick, guys. Um, I'm going to show you guys something really quick. Um, now, this is what makes no sense to me. In your guys' opinion, put in the comments below, why make a premium plane. This is a Russian premium plane, but there is, I'll even show you. Right. No. Okay, it wasn't the UK. Was it Germany? No. 
know, was it Japan? One of the countries had that premium. Was the UK? I need to see. I think it was actually. I think that was it. And I looked. Yep. So, why make a premium? Put in the comments below. Why do you think they would make a premium of the same plane? But then make a, the plane you can get for the UK. Basically, what I'm trying to say, if you guys don't understand, is put in the comment. Why do you think they make a premium of a plane that you can get for free? That is what I'm wanting you guys to put in the chat and tell me why do you think they do that? And if you know, put it in the chat if you guys want to. And yeah. Uh, how long are we into the video? Um, can't tell because on the PS4 it won't exactly tell you, so I need to literally check the time on my phone. Hold on. Okay, so it's that. Um, guys, I'm sorry if this video is really short. I cannot see the time, but I am hoping this is, has been longer than at least 15 minutes. If it is, great. I'm sorry if it's like 10 minutes long. I just cannot see the time. But please leave a like and a subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Leave a like if you guys really like this. That's all I meant to put that in there. Just leave a like really quick. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.